Amlets are a great way to add some color looks to your footage. In this lesson, we'll take a look at using Amlets inside LumaFusion. LumaFusion is available for iOS, and I'm just going to drag and drop this clip into my timeline. If you're used to Final Cut or even Premiere, this is going to be a little bit different. We just want to double tap our clip to open it up to access our color controls. The first icon is our color preset. We want to select the second icon to access our LUTs. And here is all the LUTs that you have installed. So let's use some of the M LUTs. But we'll need to put those LUTs onto our device. I can go right into my finder here and here's my LUTs and I can either drag these into Dropbox or I'm going to place this into my iCloud drive so I can access this from my iPad. Let's go ahead and bring in a new LUT. So I'm going to select from my files. Next, I'll select a LUT. Once it's installed, I'll tap it to activate it and use the slider to blend the intensity of the LUT. Tap the eye icon to disable and enable your LUT. Let's take a look at another example when we want to import a bunch of different LUTs at once. This time we'll import our LUTs again and I'm going to make sure I choose select, select all, and then open. This will select all the different LUTs in that folder all at one time. Once they're loaded, they'll populate into my LUT browser. From there, we can just use them as normal. Tap on different LUTs and use the blend slider. If we have too many LUTs or maybe a duplicate LUT, I can tap and hold on that duplicate LUT to delete it, rename it, or share it. I think I'll delete this one. Once complete, tap the top left corner to go back to your project. Let's take a look at one more situation. I have a series of different clips in my project that I want to tie together all with the same kind of LUT. I can double tap each one of my different clips and open them up just like we did before and apply my LUT to my clip. So I'm going to drag down here and I think I'll pick this review and I think next I'll blend this down a little bit. I can save this as an effect preset. I think I'll name this Piano, and then I'll click on the Save Effect Preset button in the right corner of this window. Let's go back to our other clip, and now I'll apply it right from my effect presets. So here I can just select Piano, close this, and continue on with the remainder of my clips. It's possible to combine LUTs with other color effects as well. With my LUT applied, I'll use the original color preset and dial in some brightness and change my levels. This gives me a lot more versatility than I would have with just the plain LUT by itself. You can see that there's lots of different ways to mix and match color inside LumaFusion and using M LUTs. This is a perfect solution for those filmmakers that want to use LUTs but are on location or need to be mobile. Again, I'm Stanislaw with Motion VFX. Thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you next time.